Hey everyone, I have this 2007 CR85 that I picked up a while ago. Needed a new bottom end rebuilt and a bunch of other stuff. So I've got it all rebuilt and the last thing to do is put on new graphics. Two items I recommend for this are denatured alcohol for cleaning the panels and a heat gun to peel off existing stickers and to help smooth uh, new stickers. If you have existing graphics, it helps to heat them up with a heat gun when you need to peel them off. Once you have all your stickers removed, use denatured alcohol and a clean rag to clean up all the plastic surfaces. I have all the stickers off and the panels are cleaned. Now it's time to put on new graphics. I'm going to start on the rear fender. Start from the middle. A little heat will make it go on smoother. Once I have it on there, I like to warm it up a little bit more and just smooth out all the edges. This one's done, now we can move on to the next panel. Once again, make sure it fits. I like to align it with the bolt holes. If you heat up the corners, it helps it fold over and stick better. When you heat up the vinyl, it gets stretchy and it'll stretch around compound curves. This panel is the biggest and I think it's going to be the most difficult. Again, make sure it fits. This one actually goes underneath the seat, so I'm going to take the seat off. I'm just going to kind of set it. But. All right, I think it's good. I did shorten this fender about three or four inches. So it's slightly different shape, but this sticker will still work. I'm gonna start in the middle, right here. And I'm gonna use a little bit of heat to stretch it. This side is all done, so now we can move on to the other side. All the graphics are on, so now let's just put the seat back on and we'll be done. This was a Craigslist bike I picked up and had to do a full rebuild on. All right, we're all done. I think it turned out way better. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.